see. I wanted to come to you today real quick about um, a situation that I'm having with one of my buyers. He has a VA loan and he needs to have a water test done. So just so you know, most lenders don't want you to pull your own water. It needs to be a third party. So you, your wife or husband or the seller cannot pull the water because they're directly in contact with this deal. Just like I can't pull the water for you, nor can the listing agent pull it because we all have um, an interest in this deal. So it has to be a third party. Now, his lender actually told him it needed to be a licensed person pulling the water sample. So that's the first time I've heard about that, but he just got his inspector, his inspector that did the home inspection, offered to do it. Um, if you're going to pull your own water sample just for your own knowledge, or if this is a cash deal, or if your lender allows you to pull your own, um, you can go to the Trenton Health Department, or any health department really, and they will give you the instructions and the cup for you to pull your own samples. You keep it on ice and you take it up there. Um, they only pick up on certain days and I believe it's on Tuesdays at 4. Um, but you'll have to check with your local um, health department on that. So I really just wanted to tell you guys that it's usually about 50 bucks. If you do it yourself, an inspector can charge 100 to 150. I know the inspector that we're using right now, he's actually taking it to Gainesville for us, which actually gives us a faster turnaround time. So that's good as well. Um, but I really just wanted to encourage you guys to get a water test. There are areas in the Tri-County area that do have arsenic in their water. I don't know if some people know that or not. So to have a water test is very important. Um, also, just for your knowledge and what's in your water, um, just the minerals and such. So that's a good tip to do. Also, I've heard now about surveys. Now, I've been told this time and time again by title companies that they cannot issue clear title without a survey. Well, now I'm being told by some lenders that they are not requiring surveys, but from my knowledge, they have to have a Florida Form 9 at the title company, which requires a survey to be done. So be very careful if you're not getting surveys. I have had people that have bought property or in the process of buying property and they were not going to pull a survey, but then turned around and decided to. And it's been where they thought the lines were and where the listing agent said the lines were was actually across the dirt road in the middle of an abandoned house. Who would have known? Um, also had people with houses sitting on top of the lot lines. So you really want to be careful when you're buying property, whether it's in a subdivision or not, especially the or not part, that you do get a survey done. And they do take time. They do cost money. Um, a lot of lending can wrap it into your mortgage and your closing costs, so try to get that done. But it's just a really, really, really good tip to get your surveys done. And then also with the septic. Usually what I've seen is if the house has been abandoned for more than six months or not lived in for six months, they're going to want the septic inspected, which you would probably want the septic inspected too to ensure that it works. So... That's kind of a rule of thumb if it's been, after, you know, nobody's been in it for about six months or so. But also, when you're walking the property and there's supposed to be a septic there and it is in use, make sure you really check out around the area. Make sure there's no leakage, no backup, and stuff like that. And if you have any questions, call a professional. Make sure you get it checked out if you have any questions about it because you don't want to move into a place and then have a septic problem. So really, that's what I have to tell you guys today. As issues come up with what I'm doing with my deals, I will let you know. And if you have any questions, please um, comment or share and tag somebody if they may have a question. Or you can give me 